What's up guys? This is Tampa Tech and this is my son. Devin. Why are you making that face? Like the Joker. You said to be exciting. No, that's creepy. Too bad. Anyway, um, we're going to be working on the other Game Boy. I got like, quite a few comments. Uh, you guys really wanted it to work in the last video. So I'm going to try to get it working in this video. And the last Game Boy has not yet to make the reserve price I set for it. I wasn't about to sell a working Game Boy for the same price I bought it broken. So Dad, let's go ahead. are you still in the negatives? Yeah, we're losing. So anyhow, this one does not turn on. It's not working. And I opened it up in the last video and it had severe battery acid all inside of it in the battery holder on the board. I got quite a few comments saying don't use alcohol to clean battery acid. It does very little. Use uh, white distilled vinegar. So that's what I have right here. I got it right here. This is distilled white vinegar. We're going to clean the crap out of the battery acid using what you guys recommended in the last video. All right, let's get spraying. Get one big spray right in. So we're going to spray this on this. Let's spray like it on the toothbrush. It stinks, I know. Oh, I got it on my hand. It smells so bad. This thing stinks so bad. Oh, I got it all over the place. I don't know why I sprayed so much. Yeah, me neither. And now your hand stinks. Yeah, it smells like a salad. Salad dressing. Yeah, salad smells good though. Okay. Alright, let's get cleaning. It's working! It works! Oh, I fixed it? I don't know. Whatever we did worked. We I had... fixed it. Oh, yeah, thanks. How come you didn't wait for me, Dad? Oh, why do you still have the switch parts? Wait. Oh, just... 
So we got the Game Boy working, and the other Game Boy has yet to make its reserve price. So I may have to relist that other Game Boy with this Game Boy to get my profit. I'm not going to sell the old Game Boy for the same price I bought it broken. That defeats the purpose of the eBay repair challenge where you have to make profit. So I might have to do that um, just to gain some profit on the last two challenges. Anyhow, if this video was informative, give me a big thumbs up. If you know anyone that may be interested in this video, click on the share button below and share this video to them. And of course, subscribe and hit that bell notification to stay updated on the eBay repair challenges along with Steve with Tronics Fix and Vince with my mate Vince and Elliot from the Retro Future. Their links will be in the video description below. Thanks guys for watching.